Hey guys, this is a really fast recording, so I'm gonna need to go fast. <laughs> um, so Venomoth comes out, and uh, this is a UU match against Spoinkio, and I go for the sleep battle right away, and it does hit, and he can't get up his maybe spikes or toxic spikes. Um, so I'm gonna get up my two layers of toxic spikes. He does stay asleep, and he's gonna. I'm gonna go for the buzz buzz bug buzz if I could talk. Um, get a special defense drop. Who gives a shit? Uh, put him down into the red, and he's gonna go for the ice shard. Now, the next turn, as he wakes up. So, whatever. I don't care. Um, that's not going to do anything. I do lose my focus sash, but... I, so, I mean, obviously, I wish he would have stayed asleep, but he didn't, so it's fine. Whatever. Um, he's going to go out to Torkoal, and I don't really want to take a flamethrower from this thing or risk it. So, I'm going to go out to Milotic and uh, get my flame orb. Get my flame orb on. Um... I love Flame Orb Milotic. It's awesome. This isn't a very good team. I just kind of randomly put some guys together. But uh, he's going to switch into for Alligator, predicting the water move. And I go for the Hydro Pump. And it actually is like mm, a little under a fourth, maybe a fourth. So I was actually pretty happy with that. Um, so, you know, I, I figured he would either go for DD or Sword Stance. And I would have preferred DD, to be honest, because if he's DD, he can't really touch me. Um, as I have Milotic, which is bold with, uh, Marvel scale, but, um, you know, at this point I decided, well, I don't really want to take a hit, um, I could just recover, but I'll just sag Venomoth, whatever, I'm not gonna need it. Um, just ho hopefully I can get some more poison turns on him, which I do end up doing. Um, so, then, we are going to go into Hitmonlee, he's gonna predict priority, which is smart by him. Go for the fake out. Uh, not going to do much to Rhyperior. I'm going to go out to Humiliator. Uh, I actually thought I had a Focus Ash on this thing, but I don't. I have a Life Orb, and I am going to get rolled by uh, by Earthquake. Plus, Old does not take Earthquakes well, and I really wanted to get off a of Grass Knot, so I got disappointed. going to go out to Miletic, and uh, here's classic gold, vintage gold battling right here. Go for the Hydro Pump. Miss. Get rolled by uh, an earthquake. Gonna go for the hydro pump again. Miss. And he gets a pretty much a free switch into his gator to do whatever he wants with me. Um, but you know what? I say screw you. I think he'll go for the aqua jet because people always get excited about getting kills when uh, other you know when the opponents are in the red. So I'm gonna go out to Steelix and this was a Pokemon that I completely brought as a gimmick but I figured you know what he's gonna switch out. I curse up. This is Cursed Steelix with no rest, no form of recovery. It's just Cursed Steelix, which is a beast. Um, he's going to Seed Bomb. This is going to do 11 damage. And I'm plus one. <laughs> so ludicrous. Um, I go for the EQ. Uh, and that is going to do a sizable amount to a, a Cradley. It's actually pretty nice. I'm going to go for... I'm going to predict this again. And I'm going to go to... Uh, or go for another one of those Curses. And I could have gone for uh, something else here, but I decided to go for the Earthquake. I could have gone for... Uh, I'm glad I didn't curse up, because he was obviously trying to roar. That's why he was slower. Um, got a crit. Didn't matter. I'm plus two. Uh, but I could have gone... I think I have an electric move. I think I have, like, Thunderfang or something. Anyway, he's going to go out to Torkoal, um, for fuck's sake. And he's going to Flamethrower. And I am going to take it, because I am a fucking monster. So now I'm going to... Uh, get some lefties, and he's going to go into Spoinkio, his Grumpig, and he's going to Focus Blast. And now, I was not expecting this, because I, I, in my experience, most Grumpigs are like NU special defensive walls or trick trick stuff, but um, I th actually, I think this guy has choice specs, but I know he's probably not Scarf, because this guy doesn't have great base speed, um, and that damage didn't even look like specs, but maybe, I don't know. Um, he's going to go for the Focus Blast again, as, and doesn't switch moves. He's going to go for it again and still hit, but I am just going to keep recovering until I get what I want, and what I want is him to switch or him to uh, switch moves, which I don't th I don't think he can because I think he is specs, um, but it doesn't matter. Sorry. Random heartburn during recording. Awesome. But uh, he's going to go for the seed bomb on my switch to Hitmonlee, and that is not going to do jack. Um, I know I can go for the close combat now, I predict the Rhyperior. I think he'll predict me to fake out, and he'll go to the Rhyperior, but come on, man. I'm going to go for the close combat right away. 
and uh, that's going to do over half, which was huge because Rhyperior was a big threat to me if I couldn't uh, hit my hit my Hydro Pumps, which I couldn't. Um, I'm going to go for a close comment again, get a crit. Probably didn't matter, but I don't know. Maybe it did. If it did, I'm sorry, but I, I doubt it mattered. You know, close combat is pretty pretty strong. Let's get out to Cradley. I'm gonna go for the close combat again, and ba bow. Oh, Kona Cradley from about 80% health. So that was awesome. Hitman Lee is the man. Uh, I'm gonna switch out because I think that I want priority on this thing later. So I'm gonna go to Tauros, and I don't think he can kill me with. I don't think he'll go for Focus Blast, and if he goes for Psychic, I, I don't think it would kill me. Um, and I'm just going to go for the return, and surprisingly for me, this actually took him out. So, um, good game, Swankio. And uh, I just got a couple quick updates, so stick with me for a second here, guys. Um, so, first first things first, I just got out of school. Uh, t tomorrow's my last half day, which is awesome. Uh, so, that's badass. And then, uh, and then I will hopefully be able to work on team building a little more and talk to you guys a little more. It, it'll be good. So, uh, this week I've had, I had five DCs in a row last night, um, trying to get you guys content, but it is not working. So, uh, that, that's that. So I'm, I'm trying to get you guys stuff though. And then, uh, by PMP beta viewer video of the week. Thanks to everybody who voted. And if you didn't, that's all right. And Dragonhawk551, uh, he gets a shout out for me because he got me a shout out and he has a heart gold LP. Maybe go check it out. I'll leave his channel link. Thanks.